This video explains on initial setting time of cement. Now we are going to see the initial setting time of cement and we are going to see how we will do the experiment. So this is wicket apparatus and this is wicket mold. So this is plunger which is of 1 mm square. So this is cement, now measuring jar which consists of water and weighing balance. Now we have to take the cement and remove the lumps in the cement. So lumps should be removed and now We are uh, tearing the weighing balance. Now, the cement, now we are putting the cement in the weighing balance and taking 250 grams of cement. So, you have to take 250 grams of cement. The cement should be placed in the glass board. After putting the cement, from the normal consistency of the cement, which we have done in the last video, so which we have done before itself, so normal consistency of cement, we are getting 32 percentage of water in 6 mm penetration. So 32 percentage of water to be added in the initial setting time of cement. So 32 percentage of water is percentage of water is added into 0.85 times of water is reduced. So we are going to add now 68 ml of water in the cement to find out the initial setting time. So now we are pouring 50 ml of water in the measuring jar. So 50 ml of water. So now we are pouring the water in the cement which is of 50 ml. Balance water will be placed. Now, the cement is mixed properly. So, from So the cement has been well mixed and we should see that there is no lumps particle present in the mix. Now we are going to take, going to take the wicket apparatus, wicket setup and the plunger has been placed at the bottom of the wicket apparatus. And it has been holded on the top. Now the wicket mold is removed. So uh, timing is very important in this experiment. So first, uh, as the water is poured in the cement, within two minutes we have to place the mix in the wicket mold. Now the cement which is mixed has been transferred in the wicket mold. So all the cement uh, mixtures will be transferred in the mold.
and it should be slightly damped it should be slightly damped so that the voids in the cement mixture will be cleared and now the wicket mold has been placed at the bottom of the wicket apparatus and now slowly gradually we have to remove the so now you could able to see zero is the reading so for the time zero is the reading after 10 minutes now we are going to check again the reading so we are checking the time it's 10 minutes is over so again now we have to slightly move the position which we have taken the first reading so now gradually it is left now this again zero now again we are retaining it in the original position and we have to check we have to wait for the timing and after 25 minutes now again we are checking the time so after 25 minutes so we are slowly we are re releasing the knob and the wicket needle goes and plunges inside the mold now here you can able to find 0 and this is 10 so it is 2 the point indicates reading as 2 now again uh, these, it has been placed in the original position so after 35 minutes now again we are checking the time so it is time is 35 minutes after 35 minutes we are again slowly removing and we are slightly shifting the mold to some other place and now we are checking the initial setting time the plunger penetrates into the mold and now you could able to see is 7 so the more pointer indicates 7 which is of 35 minutes